we want to solve the equation m equals the quantity y minus 4 divided by the quantity x minus 3 for the variable y. To do this, let's first clear the fractions from the equation. Remember, to clear the fractions from an equation, we multiply both sides of the equation by the least common denominator. In this case, we only have one fraction, and therefore we can clear the fractions from the equation by multiplying both sides of the equation by the quantity x minus 3. Now looking at the right side of the equation, notice how before multiplying we can simplify. The numerator and denominator share a common factor of x minus 3. x minus 3 over x minus 3 would simplify to 1 over 1. And therefore we just have the quantity y minus 4 times 1, which equals the quantity y minus 4. On the left side we have m times the quantity x minus 3. Now I do want to mention Another way that we could have cleared the fractions from the equation would be to write m as a fraction with the denominator of 1. And now we have a proportion. And whenever we have a proportion, the cross products are equal, which means m times the quantity x minus 3, which we have on the left, must equal 1 times the quantity y minus 4, which is just the quantity y minus 4, which we have here. So cross multiplying gives the same result as multiplying both sides of the equation by the quantity x minus 3. Looking at the right side of the equation, we are now one step away from solving for y. In order to isolate y on the right side, we need to undo the subtraction by adding 4 to both sides of the equation. And now we simplify both sides, starting on the right side. Adding 4 undoes minus 4, or negative 4 plus 4 is 0. So we have y on the right. On the left, there are no like terms here. We have m times the quantity x minus 3 plus 4. Let's go ahead and change the order of our equation here. We now know y equals m times the quantity x minus 3 plus 4. Or we could also distribute and say y equals mx minus m times 3. So we have minus 3m plus 4. Either of these would be correct. I hope you found this helpful.